Welcome to Video Guys Live. Tuesdays at 3 p.m. We teach you about the technology we sell, the products we sell, what's going on in our industry, what's new and what's exciting. And today's show is all about Wirecast. Wirecast is a live video production and live streaming and encoding application that is loaded with features, loaded with performance. It's priced right and it is a fantastic solution. And we're going to tell you all about it. We're going to tell you what makes it unique, what makes you want to have it, and the different uh, flavors of Wirecast that are available so that you can pick the version that's right for you. So once again, who is Wirecast live streaming for? You can capture, you can produce and stream video. So let's talk about that a little bit. Before we get into the show about Wirecast, I want to talk about something very important. We're running today's show on a Wirecast gear. So normally we use another vendor's product to do the show, but I felt because it was a Wirecast show, let's use Wirecast. So Oliver, can you pump on that shot of you? And do we have enough light there when we shut the lights for them to be able to see you working on the Wirecast? All right, so there we go. Let's get this camera in there so you can see that it's me and we're doing the live show and all that good stuff. So we're here. Oliver's doing it on the Wirecast interface. And Oliver, thanks a lot. Let's come back to me now in the show. Let's roll right in. There are two flavors of Wirecast, Wirecast Studio and Wirecast Pro. Before we get into the different flavors, though, I want to stress that either version works on just about any computer made in the last couple of years. PC or Mac, no problem. Laptop or desktop, no problem. iMac or Surface, no problem. Windows, you want to be running it on Windows 10 for best results. Uh, I, uh, the, uh, on the Mac OS, let's say the latest version, the version before it, you want a pretty modern machine and you want a machine that's got some power. Why? Because Wirecast will take advantage of your GPU and CPU speed, but you don't need the most beefiest machine, but be prepared that all the more computer power you give it, the more elaborate and complex show you can make. But for a basic show that's say two cameras cutting back and forth with some basic overlays and stuff like that, you don't really need this Mondo powerful computer and a laptop will get the job done, be it a Mac Book Pro or something like a Surface. So let's go right in and talk about Wirecast Studio. And it's really what I think is one of the easiest to use programs out there. It's great for houses of worship, corporate video, teachers with online learning and remote, uh, doing basic news shows, live event broadcasting, so many different things you could do. You're going to get unlimited inputs, unlimited destinations, simultaneous uh, remote guests with Rendezvous. You're going to get integrated stock media library, which we're going to talk about in a moment. And there's just no better, easier way. Well, that's a lie. I can't. We say there's no better way to produce your videos, but there is. It's called Wirecast Pro. 200 bucks. What do you get for Wirecast Pro for $200 more? What do you get? You get expanded inputs and outputs. You get up to seven remote guests. You get 3D virtual sets. You get PTZ camera control. You get NDI output and some additional outputs. And it's really a much more professional program. So if you want the best and you have it already, you know, Wirecast Pro, if you're going to be doing like high school sports or college sports, you definitely want Pro. If you're going to be working in an NDI environment, you want Pro. And more than that, if you think this is going to be something that you're going to use to make money or to do professionally or to do for your housework for school, for the extra $200, you want Pro. Just like the regular version Studio or Pro works on a PC, works on a Mac, laptop, desktop, iMac, or Surface. So now let's go in a little bit more because... One of the things about Wirecast that sets it apart is it's got a really cool feature. And that feature is the Wirecast Insider Access. Now, your first year when you buy Wirecast or Wirecast Pro, you get the Insider Access for free. And every year later, it's 99 bucks. What do you get for your 99 bucks? Well, it's pretty cool. You get unlimited upgrades. Anytime they come out with a new version, you get it for free during that year. You get their stock library, which we're going to go into a little bit in the next slide, which is really cool. You get on-demand training, you get access to the knowledge base, and you also get what they say is eight business hour email support, so next day support. Now, some people need more support than that. If you need higher level support, they have premium access available for $2.99 a year, and that's going to give you unlimited phone support, uh, four business hour support time over the phones, priority over other, and uh, we'll get into the gear a little bit. If you have the gear, you can get some replacement stuff. So Wirecast Insider Access, a super cool deal. You buy Wirecast or Wirecast Studio or Pro, then for $99 a year, you don't have to worry about having to renew a renewal fee or whatever. You get your renewals, you get whatever the latest versions are, and you get this amazing stock library. Now, the stock media library, we're talking about over half a million dollars worth of video clips, photos, sounds, transitions, all kinds of things to add a professional touch. 
Oliver, we've got about a one minute video to let people see a little bit more about what that's about. So let's roll that video because the guys did a great job on it. And why should I just tell you what somebody tells you better? And then boom, you're in this stock media library portal. You can see here on the left, we have our different pieces of media, video, audio, and images. Um, you can filter between them here with your video, audio, and images. You can search. Once you click on a piece of content, you can preview it over in the window over here. You can choose which kind of file type you'd like to download and use in your presentation. Plus you have a full list of metadata. So I'm gonna grab uh, close up of young businessman with blue eyes, blah, 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 blah. Let's do that. And let's do an HD quick time movie file. Look, that one comes in 4k. If you want, I'm going to click download and a new window is going to pop up the download manager. And that's going to very quickly download the content you got from the stock media library. And when it's ready, it's just going to populate right here in the, uh, layer where you added your source. So now that this is done, we should see it pop up. I can close my download manager press go. And now I have this HD video that I just pulled from the stock media library. So I want to go into a little bit more about what you get with the access. And that is when we talk about the unlimited knowledge and things, can we pull this up full screen? This is the Wirecast tutorials resource that you have here. So you can see we've got getting started tutorials. There's a bunch we've got, uh, on production. Wow. We've got them on setting up streaming. We're talking about hundreds of videos. They've got webinars, they've got literature, documentations, case studies, so much good stuff for you to see on this page of Wirecast tutorials and resources. So it's such an easy place to get started, to get going. And I love that about it. And I'm going to cut to another tab here because a lot of people say, you know, what's the difference between Wirecast Studio and Wirecast Pro? Well, this is a complete table that I'm gonna just quickly scroll through here so that people can see it. We've actually taken this table apart a little bit and we're gonna bring you in-depth little pieces as we go through different pieces of a comparison on the, uh, when we do the PowerPoint presentation, we're gonna to refer to that, but I just wanna let everyone know that it's there and it's available. So let's go now to the back of the PowerPoint and let's talk about capture with Wirecast. Now Wirecast has a lot of different ways that you can capture into it. First of all, you can use a webcam as a USB capture device. You can use NDI, which is any of the NDI, like an NDI PTZ camera or like the Panasonic CX350 or CX10, which are NDI. You can bring a phone in. We're going to get that in a little bit. And you can also use a converter. That's a USB converter to now bring in HDMI or SDI into your computer using a converter like the AVIOs from Epifan, which we love. Also, qu folks, quite frankly, there is a ton of under $100 converters out there right now that are USB to HDMI converters that some of them work really great and some of them not so great. What I recommend you do, if you're going to get one of those, give it a try and make sure it's really working for you before you depend on a live show with it because... Oliver, we've lived through that mess before trying these out. And some people swear by and love them. I swear by the AVIOs. I feel they're built more rugged. They're more dependable. They don't overheat. You know you get what you're getting with them. They are more expensive. But I think when you're doing live productions that matter, worth every penny. You don't want to find out that your little HDMI $99 adapter is the reason why your show broke up because you lost the camera. All right, talked about using your phone. Now, this is an iOS app only called Wirecast Go. Now, Wirecast Go, the base free version, has a super cool feature. It allows you to use your Wi Fi network, that's the same network that your Wirecast is set up. And now you can use that camera as a, that phone as a camera to bring in another camera source for your production. So if you have two or three people in a studio or two or three iPhones that you have from prior years of the setup, you can bring those in as sources for your Wirecast with the free Wirecast Go app. The other feature they have is Rendezvous. Rendezvous allows you to bring in remote guests using cell service. So they have their cell phone and let's say I'm in New York and Glenn's in Texas or someone's in California. I can send them a code that they click on a link that then on their phone, their phone can come into our show. Very cool. We've used it before. We're going to go into that a little bit later in the show. We talk about how we did some remote, uh, uh, total remote productions when, when, the, when the pandemic was first starting. But between Rendezvous and Go, there's a lot of cool ways that you can utilize cell phones, iPhones to bring them into 
your show. So very cool. I want to make sure we talk to that. And one of the differences is Wirecast Studio lets you bring in two rendezvous guests. Wirecast Pro lets you bring up to seven rendezvous guests. Very cool. Next, I want to talk about Wirecast and NDI. Yes, Wirecast is a phenomenal partner of New Tech and VizRTs on NDI, and they have the right way to do NDI. They've been doing NDI for the longest time. They're supporting NDI 4.5, and through NDI with the Wirecast Studio or Pro, you can capture any NDI devices. So if you fire up Wirecast, like we did in our studio, all our NDI PTZ regular cameras and this <clears throat> laptop come in via NDI as sources. And it's also got a built-in web browser that lets you see web pages via NDI. Now, over here, this is a table that we're going to go full screen on. These are the different captures, ways you can capture into Wirecast Studio, Wirecast Pro. And I want to remind you that really, they're all there. There's a little bit of thing with a Teradek uh, stream reader plugin, but that's not really what this show is about. But pretty much anything from a capture point of view, you could do with Studio, you could do with Pro. Let's switch over now to producing your video production. Now, one of the things I want to stress is some of the things I'm going to get to in this part of the show are going to be Wirecast Pro only, where others are studio. And I'm going to make sure that I let you know when it's a pro feature so that you understand. That's one of the reasons we're doing the show. But first of all, whatever version you have, better and better built-in integration with the various social media. So Twitter, you can comment and cure, curate and display, integrated Facebook polling and live viewer counts. Uh, I love how they're integrating and doing this stuff with Wirecast more and more every day. And one of the things that I want to stress is that when you're doing live streaming, whether you're a house of, church, house of worship, education, or corporate, it's that interactivity. It's that relating where you let your, your audience participate that really takes your show over the top. So this integrated social media interaction that Wirecast gives you is very important and a very strong reason why Wirecast should be one of the solutions you're thinking about for your live streaming. Next, we want to talk about PTZ cameras. Now, one of the cool things is there is integrated NDI PTZ camera control in Wirecast Pro. Now, we're running a Wirecast gear, so it's got Wirecast Pro on it. So one of the things that we're going to do right now is Oliver is going to switch to the camera that's on him, and he's going to show us how he's going to work this P100, Bird Dog P100 camera, and he's actually going to tilt back and forth or do whatever he's going to do to show you that he's got some control over there. And I'm just looking over the side because that's where my monitor is. But hey, P100, come on back to me, buddy. All right, there we are. So just an example, very cool that you can do that. You can put your presets in there. I love that you have camera control from the PTZ. Very cool feature, way to go, Telestream on the Wirecast Pro. The other place that we're seeing a lot of people are using Wirecast Pro for is sports. With the Pro version, you get a lot of advanced, uh, you get instant replay, re instant replay, scoreboard, clocks, and timers, which are very, very cool. So when we're looking about, when you're thinking about pro sports production, Wirecast Pro is great for sports production. It doesn't have to be professional, it could be a college, it could be a club team, but we really recommend Wirecast Pro for sports. So let's look a little bit at this slide, bring it up full screen again. Some of the stuff over there, you see both, that, that, that's in everything what it's got, but I want, to I want to stress on the bottom corner where you're going to see, you get manuals, this is what's in Pro, scoreboards, manual scoreboards, advanced rendezvous, built-in PTZ camera control, instant replay, virtual set background. So Pro, $200 more for Pro. Pro or Studio both come with the uh, stock library for the first year. And then you, for $99 a year, you can get the access, which gets you the stock media and unlimited upgrades during the year. Let's talk about streaming because, heck, that's the key to a Wirecast is it's great that you can produce video, but we want to stream. We want to go out there. Well, Wirecast produces unlimited destinations. You can stream to Facebook Live, Twitter, YouTube, Vimeo Live, any destination via RTMP and now SRT caller mode support. And that supports multiple different resolutions of your choice. And if we can just go full screen on this, only because I wanted people to be able to see just some of the applications, some of the choices you get here, you know, all the pull downs for how you can set up your own stream. So thank you a lot for that. Uh, Oliver. Next is a feature that's in Wirecast Pro that I think is really critical if you're going to be doing 
live streaming and events, and that's ISO recording. ISO recording means you can record all the different camera inputs and the output for your show. So we use ISO recording all the time. We do it because sometimes when we do the live show, there's a glitch, we missed a cut or something like that. The guys will take it back into Premiere or Avid, they'll edit it, they'll go back to the camera source that they wanted, they've got that original footage. So ISO recording to me, worth every penny alone of the $200 more that Wirecast Pro costs over studio. And if you're seeing a theme here, folks, you're absolutely right. And my theme is very simple. If you can afford the extra 200 bucks, get the pro version of Wirecast Pro. There's probably $500 worth of value in there or more, and it's only $200 more, $599 to $799. You also get expanded output options. What do we mean by that? Well, you can put a card in your computer to be able to go, you know, a Blackmagic or an AJA card to take output via HDMI or SDI from your, compu from your computer, but also you get NDI output, which is even cooler, because now if you're running on a laptop, that NDI output can be used to feed another source, another device, or whatever you have, or it could be a TriCaster. So you can go from Wirecast to a TriCaster with NDI, and I love Wirecast Pro's NDI output. It really completes the whole NDI workflow solution. Just another reason to step up to Pro. All right, so now let's bring up another slide full screen if we could. And you're going to see with the output with, with it, uh, you're getting stuff for both. You know, both versions give you SRT. Both versions have GPU acceleration. They can record to disk. You get Facebook Live, virtual camera. But what you get with Pro is ISO record, program feed output, NDI output, multiple streams with differing language or audio tracks, and multi-track audio recording. And I just, once again, Wirecast Pro is just worth the 200 bucks, folks. If you've got it, spend it. I understand if you're on a tight budget, you got to get Studio to go. But Pro is definitely worth every extra penny of 200 bucks. All right. I'm going to say, all right, I'm, I'm only said all right about four times this show. So I think I'm below my quota. I'm figure I'm good for another four to six by the time the show is over. Let's talk about video conferencing software, be it Zoom or Teams. We know we're all doing it. And Wirecast supports it tremendously. Now, through Wirecast Zoom or Wirecast through Wirecast with Zoom or with Teams, you get a level of integration that's really cool using some of these really cool features that are inside Wirecast that you can take advantage of. So you can use the uh, virtual browser in order to be able to bring it in and out. And it's very, very cool. And we have used Wirecast with Teams and with Zoom. And if you'll all recall in the early days of the uh, pandemic, we had to be shut down. And when we really only had three people in our offices and everyone in our marketing and production team was remote, we produced our shows remotely using Wirecast gear. Wirecast gear was at uh, Adam's house, I believe. Oliver had a computer running some other stuff on it. We were bringing in a whole show remotely from, I was in my office. We weren't even in the studio at that time because you weren't allowed to have more than one person in an office. You know, everyone was, you know, we didn't think this was going to last a year, but we knew we had, to, we had to figure out what to do. So we went remote and we did three or four remote shows back then. And I just want to let you see on this slide, if we can bring it up full screen, you can still find all three of those webinars online on our YouTube page and also from our website. And if we could, I want to make sure the metadata when we do the blog, let's put links to these three webinars at the end, guys, if we could. Cool. And that's Oliver waving in that picture. And Oliver's still here with doing the same exact wave that he just did to me. So great job, Oliver. Now I want to talk about Wirecast Gear. What is Wirecast Gear? It's simple. Wirecast Gear is a dedicated computer built with workstation uh, server class components so that you can run Wirecast and push it to the limit and get everything you want out of it. There's four flavors of Wirecast Gear. I'm going to go into them briefly. Three flavors. There's the 310, which is 5995 That's four HDMI inputs. That's why I had four stuck in my head. There's the 320, which is $69.95, which is for SDI inputs. And then there's the 420, which is $89.95. Now, what that gives you is five SDI captures and an SDI program output. I really think that that is... The, the Wirecast Gear 420 is probably my favorite under $10,000 solution for 
houses of worship and schools and corporate video that really need to be volunteer operator controlled. As we've shown you in this webinar, Wirecast is really easy to use and set up. Right out of the box, you can get up and going on a Wirecast production in probably 15, 20 minutes. You'll watch a few videos. So maybe you watch two hours worth of videos and 30 minutes later, you're up and streaming. You can download the demo version, have on a computer to play around with. It's a great system when you're having volunteers and not having super trained you know, people. Of course, as your people use it and get better and better, as your people use it over time and get more and more experience, they'll get better and better at it and learn how to use it even more powerfully. But from my point of view, if you're going to get Wirecast gear, you can get up and going in the fastest turnaround time of any other system that's out there on the market. And part of the reason for that is, is that everything comes pre-configured, pre-installed on the box. If you're going to get Wirecast gear, one of the things I want to talk about is gear care. Gear care gets you Three years of premium access and hardware support for a thousand bucks. The key to that hardware support is you get an advanced replacement. If they determine that a card or something broke in the machine, they will send you that part ahead of time. You get the free upgrades, you get telephone support. It's $9.95. Once again, worth every penny if you're putting Wirecast gear into a house of worship or an educational thing where kids are going to be using it every week, or if you're a corporate video place that's going to be producing corporate video or a government agency for that matter. So it's a little bit of extra security. I think you're going to find we're going to talk about that a lot this year. A lot of the products we sell are, are more a, a, a complete workflow solutions do have care or training packages available with them. And I just think they're a tremendous value. And I think the thing about live that's a little bit different than maybe post-production is you can't really always fix, well, you can fix anything in post. Live events only happen when they happen. So we always recommend, you know, rehearsing, practicing, working with your stuff. But you want to know that if stuff doesn't go right, God forbid, you're going to get to the right people to get your show back up and running as fast as possible. That's one of the peace of mind that something like Wirecast uh, Gear Care gives you. All right, I hope you enjoyed today's show. I kept it to that 20 minute. I'm really trying hard to keep our shows back to 20 minutes. I know that I've run longer for the past few shows, but the TED Talks are 18 minutes for reason of science shows. That's what people want to watch. So I'm going to wrap this show really up fast. Wirecast Studio, $5.99. Phenomenal product to get started. Runs on PC or Mac, desktop, laptop, doesn't matter. Studio Pro, $7.99. Worth the 200 extra bucks. We went through all the features you have. You get the access care for free for the first year, $99 afterwards. With that, you get the stock photography, the stock media that integrates directly into Wirecast. Plus, you get all the upgrades that come out for that year during that period. And then we have the Wirecast gear, hardware, and software systems starting at $599.95. Guys, it's a great show on Wirecast. Recommend it highly. Once again, if you have any questions about Wirecast, Wirecast Studio, Wirecast Pro, Wirecast Gear, Give us a call at 800-323-2325. We've got people here who use it, who can help you understand what you need, what's the right fit for you, what other gear you need, be it PTZ cameras, capture devices, or something like the X-Keys controller, which is for a whole nother show, but it's a cool little controller with pre-programmed hot points that you can put right into your, 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 your uh, pre-programmed shortcut keys that you can use for your production. So guys... This is Gary from Video Guys. The usual stuff. Love us, like us on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, you name it. Share the love, share the videos, share the clips. Give us a call at 800 2325 if you have any questions. This is Gary from Video Guys. Peace. Thank you for watching this week's Video Guys live webinar. Join us every week, Tuesdays at 3 p.m. on Facebook and YouTube for more great shows on the latest live streaming, video editing, and storage technology. Coming up next week, March 30th, we'll be discussing some great encoders to help you get started or set up your live production. The following week, April 6th, we'll be coming to you with a live show on some exciting new new tech bundles. Video Guys is available Monday through Friday. Give us a call at 1-800-323-2325. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter and Instagram to stay connected with all of our updates. And you can like us on Facebook too. Keep an eye out for our live videos and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. And then boom, you're in this stock media library port.